There's a lot of people who like to start seeds before it gets to planting season so they can get a jump start. And there's several ways you can do it. And I'm just gonna show you a way to be successful. So a lot of people when they're planting seeds, they just plant them, doesn't matter what you plant them in, but they plant them and then they water it and they think they're watering it enough, but they aren't. So a lot of people when they're starting seeds, they have a spray bottle and every morning, maybe two times a day, they spray it down. And then after a few weeks, they're like, I am not seeing any growth, how come that is? So I'll show you what we do in the professional world, when we have access to a greenhouse, we use something called a mist bench. And a mist bench mists periodically throughout the day, every 15 or 20 minutes, depending on what's growing. And so it stays moist, like this will not stay moist, so it's not gonna have much success. But if you have access to a mist bench, then you would have something like this sprout up. So it stays moist enough for everything to keep sprouting. Now, of course, not everyone has access to a mist bench. So one thing you can do is you can basically make a terrarium so it'll grow. So after you get your seeds planted, you can make a terrarium with a little bit of cling wrap. You just put it over here. All right, just in a, in a little bit, you'll see condensation forming. It'll show you that it's uh, becoming a terrarium and it'll stay moist. And so you can do that. Or if you don't want to do that, you can also just use a Ziploc bag. So I've done that. I planted these. I watered them once. I put them in a bag and I never touched them again. So this is what we got with that. Okay, no mist bench. They still came up just fine. But you will notice that these guys are leaning and growing one direction. That's because I had it next to a windowsill. So that's another thing you have to deal with. They get really long. This is called etiolation. They get really long while they're reaching for the light. Whereas if you have light coming from the top, they grow up nice and straight. So one thing I did as another experiment, I had not a mist bench, just a bag. And I put a light really close to it, like that far from the tops of the seeds. And if you do that, there's no sunlight on one side and not on the other. So things tend to grow up straight. So this has just been a few days, but notice they're growing up straight and they're not growing out sideways. So if you have, if you're gonna start seeds indoors, keep them moist, keep them away from the window and just a regular light, just as long as it's like 5,000 K, regular daylight, you just keep it really close and it'll grow straight. So that's the best way to start seeds successfully. We hope you enjoyed this video as part of our Oklahoma Gardening YouTube channel. You can also find even more videos on the OK Gardening Classics YouTube channel. And join us on social media for great gardening tips, photos, and discussion.